Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to connect Moodle lists on your Wix website in 2023. Moodle lists is a dropshipping platform that allows you to source high quality products from top suppliers and sell them directly on your Wix website without managing inventory or shipping. By integrating Moodle lists with your Wix website, you can expand your product offering and increase your revenue. So let's dive in. Before we start with this video, Make sure to watch it from now till the end so you have full experience. So now what we need to do, of course, is just go and open whatever browser you're going to use to follow this tutorial steps with. Here in my case, I'm actually using Brave. But of course, in your case, you can use any other browser could be possibly working for you. As an example, you can use Google Chrome, you can use Firefox, you can use Opera, you can use Brave like me, even an Internet Explorer if it's working for you. So whatever browser you have or you want to use, go ahead and use it. Once you do that, of course, you can simply go to your URL section and simply type wix.com and hit the enter button. That should take you directly to the home screen or the main screen of Wix website. And of course, here, if you have an account, you can simply click on the login option and that will take you to this page. Of course, here you can simply enter your email and check this remember me option if you don't want to keep logging in into your account every time you get into the site or into the website. Of course, if you forgot your email, you can simply click here so you can get it back or remember it. Of course, make sure to read this term of use and privacy policy so you don't get in any future troubles. As you can see, you can read them very carefully because it's very important so you don't have any problems in the future with Wix company. Of course, this site is protected by reCAPTCHA Enterprise, Google Privacy and Terms of Use apply, so make sure to read them. And of course, you can even log in into your account with Google, Facebook or even Apple or with your SSO. If you don't have an account, make sure to click on the sign up option and of course, from here, you can create your account by entering your email, then retyping your email, creating a password and type in your password again, then clicking on sign up. Of course, again, you can create your account with a Google account or even Facebook account. And by signing up, you're agreed to our term of use and the knowledge you've read our privacy policy. It's the same as I showed you before. So for me, let me just fill this information real quick right here. Let's see an example that's going to be my email. I'm just going to retype it or like this. The password, let's say it's going to be something like this. And let's just re enter it. And here we are. As I said, you can or you don't have to fill all of those if you want. You can simply click Add Continue with Google if you have your Google account already connected and choose the email or the Gmail that you want to connect with. For me, I choose the same email that I choose here. So now let me just save this. So next time I want to log in or something, I'll not have to fill those manually. And here I'll have to answer a quick survey. So let's set up with the right tools first. Who are you creating websites for? Of course, you can answer those questions or you can simply click on skip. So do whatever suits you for me. Let's say as an example for me or my business or friend. So click on continue. And here, what kind of websites are you creating? Let's say as an example, online store. Click on next. Should not take a lot of time this survey. And of course, if you're getting bored, as I said, always click on skip. Enter your store name. Let's say as an example, it's going to be something like this. Click on next. Because this survey will even help you uh, understand them a lot and even they will, will even help you and give you a recommendation based on your survey right here. So let's say an example is going to be blog, I don't know, maybe music, video, and click on next. Why not? So here, as you can see, we can simply now go to our dashboard. And as you can see, they are preparing my dashboard right now. So I'll have to wait a couple of seconds and I'm going to be right there. So as you can see, now we are at the dashboard of my Wix account. And here, of course, I would like to finish this 
steps to set up my store as an example i'll have to add a first my first products and then set up a payment method then of course set up shipping and delivery address then design my website then connect to a custom domain then get found by customers on google so first of all of course we would like to go to this left panel if you want to connect model list on our wix website and click on this apps which is the last option that will take us to the app market of wix website here you would like to go to the search apps option and type model list the list like that and hit the enter button that should take you to this page what you would like to do now is just click on this model list drop shipping design and create custom products to sell online and click on it of course this app is available worldwide as you can see so you can use it wherever you are on this planet of course the language provided or supported by the app is english and this app has some sites requirements is you would like to have a Wix store on your Wix. Of course, if you completed the setting up steps of your account, you will already have that and you will not even have this red warning, as you can see, because you will have to add your first product and design your website. And that means store. That means you will not have this warning on red. And that means you will be able to add it to your site without any problems. Of course, this app will not just let you connect your model list with your Wix website, but it will give you a lot of other features, like choose from thousands of bitted dropshipping suppliers with high quality products and reliable, reliable uh, order fulfillment. And you can now design and create print on demand products to grow your brand and a lot of other features. You can click on read more here and you will be able to read all of the features that comes with this model list dropshipping app so of course if you have any concerns you can always scroll down and see the average rating of the app which is 4.4 it's a decent average rating and this average rating is based then over 700 reviews so don't worry and of course you can even see the bad things and the good things about this app in the comments or the reviews down below if you convinced that you would like to add it simply click on add to site as i said as i told you i cannot add it because i don't have a wix store which is the site requirement and for you will have to simply click on add to site once it's added you'll be able to customize it depending on the theme of your website uh, and of course you'll be able to add the colors or to design the colors or customize the colors the fonts the, the themes and a lot of other stuff and of course once you're done you can simply go open another browser and go to your store as a customer to check if everything is working perfectly. If not, you can always come back to the apps option and go back to the model list drop shipping and edit whatever you want. So that's it for this tutorial on how to connect model lists on your Wix website and 2023. With model lists, remember that you can offer your customer a wide range of unique and high quality products from top suppliers without worrying about inventory management or shipping. So start and increasing your sales and integrating modulus with your Wix website today and make yourself a better life and take your e-commerce business to the next level. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more tutorial like this. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one.